So guys, for the first method, you wanna head over to search and type in settings, click on it. And then once you're on this on the left hand side, you wanna click on accounts. And now you wanna scroll down till you find access work or school. If you're currently connected to a work or school account, you want to disconnect from it and then connect to it again, see if that works for you. And now for the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in edit group policy, click on it. If you do not have group policy, just skip over to the next method. And then once you're on this, under computer configuration, you wanna expand administrative templates. And now you wanna expand Windows components. And now you wanna scroll down till you find Windows update. You wanna click on it. And now you wanna click on manage end user experience, this one right here. Double click on it, and now this will come up. And then once we're here, you wanna double click on configure automatic updates. You wanna make sure that this has been set to not configured, and then click on okay. See if that works for you. And now for the next method, you wanna head over to search again and type in view advanced system settings. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on computer name. And then you wanna click on network ID. And now you wanna select, this is a home computer, it's not part of a business network. Unless you actually are using a business network computer, but most of you guys are probably gonna be using a home computer. So now you wanna click on next. And then click on finish. And then click on okay. And then click on restart now, and then the problem should be fixed.